Hello, my angel. I want to welcome you and this is the beginning of something new. You don't really know where it leads you, but you can trust it. And what I want to tell you is that the main lesson for you right now is to trust. Trust your ins instincts. Instincts. <laughs> Trust the stumbling, even if your mouth is stumbling. And yes, even trust the doubts that you don't need to know where it leads you. And you don't need to be perfect because, yes, that's the first, the very first obstacle that that is... Um, standing right in front of you now that you think that you have to do everything perfect and it's it has a crippling effect on you and that's why i decided to step in front and ask to speak through you because um, something's gotta give <laughs> you know there is this saying and i thought that if I ask to confront, then you can receive the gift that you are ready for. And I know that you thought that this journey is going to be something different, very different. You thought that it's going to be much easier. And you still think that tears make you weak. But never forget that just a couple of years ago you were not even able to cry so this is a big step forward and yes it can seem like you are not confident at all and sometimes you, you look at others who seem to be more confident with all the makeup on, literally, and with other defense mechanisms, it seems that they are so confident, but without those makeups, without those extras, that confidence wouldn't be there, and that's why you don't want to use those tools, because that's not the confidence that you want to build. So, this way, that you can see now, even with this uh, first step, that this is just a habit, that this is just a habit that you're talking um, from the wounded one you're talking as the wounded one because this one wants to be heard and wants to be seen so and who is going to see her if not you So right now what's um, relevant is to 
not judge the given steps because it doesn't look like something you want but it is something that you can accept and it's right in front of you this step this way that you started to walk on and you have this very strong feeling now that you're better than this which is true but there is another question a more burning question which is what can you receive right now because you started to see new layers of guilt and unworthiness in your mind so you have to walk through these layers and it's gonna be very uncomfortable and I know that you hate when someone is pushes you but now you have to push through kind of you know it's just a figure of speech so I have to concentrate on the energy behind it and yes I mean don't let others push you this push has to come from within and then you will step in and out of certainty and doubt this is just how it's gonna go and you discover this new expression that resonates with you right now which is struggling to make things right because of this sense of guilt that's there and there is such a deep desire to make things right and this is just a desire for healing and atonement but a lot of, a lot of self-judgment how it looks in form and all the ideas and the, and the deep desires for for really embodying the light within so we we have this uh, next step this uh, next stepping stone that you can receive that kind of matches your desire and that's why you can accept it uh, and which is simple because what you really need right now is simplicity in your mind and not to make things more complicated honor your own rhythm which is what this next stepping stone um, offers you that is so important honor your own rhythm even in the hours of the day and don't listen to other voices that say that say, say that this is not normal because what is normal all these judgments have the effect that the doubt just magnifies so as this first uh, message and <laughs> remembrance that your own cosmic angel lies within and uh, this is the perfect uh, next step to continue and everything will unfold 
you can expand because that's your heart's desire. But at the same time, embrace the wounded one, the, the tears. And it's okay if you don't feel like laughing because that's the way it is then. So don't push yourself in this way because you don't see yet why it's easier for you to cry right now than laugh and and there is a reason for that too and uh, laughter will come but just focus on what's right in front of you and and just remember the baby steps <laughs> because we're breaking um, addiction patterns habits are addiction patterns too and so that's why I just take one day at a time and you can give yourself a pep talk you can be your own friend and you can reach out if you want to join and the next step will always reveal itself and I promise you it will just be a baby step, a step that you can take and a step that you will feel right in your heart. And this new discovery about the struggle within to make things right, just honor that. Honor that because the desire is pure. So, your own cosmic angel awaits for you <laughs> and this one will give you a pep talk every time you need <laughs> bye but just for now <laughs>